Hi everyone, my name is Tony Willey, and welcome to another exciting episode of, Sky of Fallout 4 uh, mod tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to download and install Body Slide and Outfit Studio for, for um, along with Caliente's beautiful body enhancer, CVVE, on Mod Organizer 2 for Fallout 4. Now each one of these, I'm going to recommend that you can download each one of them into the Mod Organizer 2. And I'm going to show you how to do that today. For Body Slide, you're going to go ahead and download it to the manager like you normally would with any other mod. And the same with CVBE for Fallout 4. Now with Dismember, you can do that as well um, if you want for that file. For um, Honor Garments Fix as well, you can download that to the mod and everything you know you normally would with CVBE. Now, while CBBE is installing, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to install Body Slide. So, okay, you're going to go ahead and put Body Slide and uh, put the version. I usually recommend putting the version that you have in case it gets updated. Okay, you're going to go to Manual, make sure everything's working the way it's supposed to, and then click OK. All right, now that it's installed, you make sure you it's, it's highlighted, and uh, you check over here to make sure it has any ESPs or um, ESM files. Just click Check. Body Slide, make sure it's under the script extender. And you, as you normally would here. Now we want to add body slide to the executable so we can load it up like we normally would. Click here and put body slide and outfit studio. Go to the binary, and you're going to go to your fall your um, your um, M M02 Fallout 4 uh, directory. Go to your mods. Go to your body slide. Go to your your tools. Go to Body Slide and click the Body Slide X, X64 EXE file. Before you start, though, I would recommend right click it and run as administrator. Click Yes. Choose Fallout 4, as you would see here. And click Exit. And then click the Open. Click Add. Click Close. Alright, now that we've added it here, Body Slide is now there. Now, you can add it to the toolbar up here, so you can just click it here anytime you load up Mod Organizer 2, or you can add it to the desktop if you don't want to actually load up Mod Organizer 2. I'm click Desktop. Now, as you can see at the desktop, is it's down here. You can go ahead and right click it, and then click Properties. And we want to change the icon to the body slide one, so click Change Icon, click Browse. Now, I go to my Mod Organizer 2 um, directory for Fallout 4, go to Mods, go to Body Slide. Click Tools, click Body Slide, click on the EXE file because it has the icon. Click Open. There's the icon. Click OK. Click Apply. As you see, as it changed, and then click OK again. And you can always load Body Slide from the actual um, desktop if you like. All right, everyone. So once Caliente's beautiful bodies enhancer has been downloaded, all you do is install it like you normally would. Okay. Once it's installed, you can choose any body shape you'd like. I usually choose vanilla. Of course, never nude. And you just choose whatever ones you're using uh, for outfits. I don't have these DLC, so I won't be adding those. And you can also add in the F4 uh, E-Morphs if you like. Okay, and we're going to go ahead and install it. Make sure at the top you have your name. All right, once it's installed, all you got to do is activate the mod. Right? And you can put up, up here usually the highest, usually above right here. And we're going to go ahead and activate Body Slide. And the reason you want Kelly and Beautiful Bodies and Enhancers installed is it's because it's the one that carries all the Body Slide files that you'll need for conversion and everything else for the normal outfit. We'll be doing Never Nude and the presets as well it has down here, okay? As you can see, I have the um, setup here with the, the textures. Now, when you're building your body for Body Slide, okay, you want to make sure that when you're doing the textures, you can you know make your adjustments as you normally would however when you're in Mod Organizer 2 you don't want to actually build the body or the build batch for the body preset while you're seeing the textures and the reason for that is actually very simple it will go directly to your data folder from Mo for Fallout 4 okay and that's what we do not want it to do. We want it to go to the Mod Organizer Fallout 4 Override folder. So we can create a mod with it. So you click Select here, click OK, and as you will see, the textures will no longer be there. Alright? 
and that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that while you're building your body, okay? So when you build your body for um, Fallout 4, you can do physics as well, all right? When you build your body, you want to make sure there's no textures on the thing. Otherwise, it'll go straight into the data folder. We we'll Go ahead and click build. Or if you want, you can do a build batch. So we'll click here. And we'll, it'll build all the bodies and clothing that are associated with the body for the female character. Click build. Okay, once it's done, click OK. And then you exit out of, out of body slide. Click your override folder. And as you can see, all the meshes are here with the clothing, the body itself. Okay, and then the armors, etc. Alright, so all you're going to do is right-click it, create mod. We'll go CBBE body slide. Go to uncheck, click it, and there you have it. Your body for the female body is now installed. Okay? And you'd run your game like you normally would. And you can see the change on the body. Alright, everyone. That's it. That's how you install body slide in Office Studio along with CBBE. Bodies enhancers for uh, and how you create the body for Mod Organizer 2. If you, uh, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section down below. If you guys like my video, please go ahead and like and share with your friends. If you like my channel, please go ahead and subscribe. Once again, my name is Tony Wale. Thank you so much for the click, and I will see you next time.